What's up guys, Trilogy here. Today we're doing another food video. This is gonna be for the Flaming Hot Cool Ranch Taco from Taco Bell. And let me tell you what, I've been asleep on these things cause I mean, there was a girl I used to talk to and she loved the Dorito hard tacos from Taco Bell. And I was just like, why would you get the hard taco when you can get the soft taco? You know what I'm saying? I'm a soft taco man. But um, I recently got the Taco Pass, which I am eventually gonna do a review on the Taco Pass after 30 days pass. And I'm gonna be like, did I get my money's worth? So I'm not going to Taco Bell more than I usually do, I guess. I feel like I'm not anyways. But I'm just gonna be like, after 30 days, was this $10 of value? Which, mind you, I did get my free taco today. But I mean, um, included in the taco pass, you do get the supreme variants. So I was just trying different tacos on there because you get a free taco every day. And I tried the regular nacho supreme and that thing, the regular Dorito nacho supreme. I said, whoa, this thing has been here all this time? Like, I'm really sleep on it. So when they said they were doing the Cool Ranch one, I definitely had to check it out, you know? Although, I have the chips here, because I saw these at Walmart, 50 cents, you know? I wanted to try these, but the chip bags are like three, four dollars, which I guess is normal for chips. It's just a big investment for some chips that I might not like, you know what I'm saying? I like the Cool Ranch. But I don't know if I like flaming hot Cool Ranch. Like, that's a big waste. When I could go get some Funyuns, you know what I'm saying? Some Funyuns, some sweet honey barbecue, the the sweet, sweet spicy chili Doritos. I could get any of those. So I haven't messed with them. But I'm going to try the new taco, and I'm going to try the new chips today on this video and see if I like both of them better. I do have the regular Dorito one. Um, but yeah, my taco is a mess. See, this is the taco uh boom this is the taco on the inside my taco bell was obviously tripping because they had tomatoes and stuff stick on the side of this honestly this isn't even what i ordered i ordered the regular one because i was being cheap and this is the supreme variant but you know what supreme versus supreme because now i have the this one and i got the other one so let's test it out let me lower this again a little bit i guess so you can catch this bite The flaming hot, it's there. I taste it like the spice is dancing on my tongue. Woo! It's not super hot, but it has like a burning aftertaste on my tongue. I don't really taste any of the cool ranch, you know? It's just burning. Woo! Woo! Let's take. Let me get some more lettuce on this thing. <laughs> oh me, I need some more sour cream to counteract this hot. Okay, well, that was the flaming hot cool ranch. It was flaming all right. <laughs> I don't know about cool ranch. Woo! For anyone out there who's like, yeah, you might have better spice taste buds for me. Cause I don't really mess with spicy stuff. I like spicy Mexican food. I like spicy queso. 
And when I say spicy, I mean like hot. I don't mean like actual spices. I mean like, whoo, burn. Woo! Had to cool down. I've had it before, but just for the video. See there, this is the regular one. Look at this, it just got all this cheese on the side. They got tomatoes and stuff like that. Taco Bell does not care. But I'm just gonna take a bite of this real quick. This is just the normal nacho Dorito taco. Mmm. Yeah, it's not a contest. It's not a contest at all. I definitely preferred the regular nacho taco over the spicy Cool Ranch one. I don't know, if you like spicy stuff, you might like it. But the, to be clear, I don't dislike it because it's spicy. I just don't like the taste, and I prefer the regular nacho cheese flavor over that. And we got the chips. I do want to try these out, even though I didn't like the nacho. Trying this out will actually let me tell you if it tastes like the taco. It does have the same color scheme, though, so I'm thinking it's made exactly from one of these. Now look, when I taste these, I can taste the cool. Oh, I was about to pop another one of these in my mouth. Then the heat started kicking in. Hold on. <coughs> Woo! And it was all on, it was on one side of my mouth. So just this side of my mouth is just burning right now. That's crazy. This chip is definitely more spicy than the taco. I was thinking the taco didn't have enough cool to counteract that spice, but maybe it did have enough cool it's burning, boy. I'm about to take this sweater off. Jeez. Woo. It's burning, boy. Is it? I'm over here sweating. Whew. Yeah. Them flaming Hots are just built different, you know what I'm saying? And the flaming Hot Taco, it's not... If you like the flaming Hot Chips, the taco might not even be hot enough for you because this chip is hotter than the taco. Maybe the sour cream and lettuce was doing its job because I thought it wasn't doing its job. But now that I taste the chip by itself, I'm over here like, wow. Yeah, but anyways, that's my review on the Dorito Slamin' Hot Hard Taco. I'm Trilogy with Trilogy Effect. We do food videos, movies, gaming, all kinds of content like this on my channel. You should definitely subscribe. I also do a podcast every Friday with news and stuff like that. <coughs> the spice is still getting me. Trilogy Talk, that comes out on Friday. You should definitely check it out. I have curated playlists. Like, comment down below if you really want to support the channel. You can subscribe. I also have a Patreon. You can help for a little as a dollar a month. Donate, and I will spend it on the next crazy food item that comes out. Comment down below if there's anything out there I should be trying, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. I love the hustle, man. I be feeling like one of them ball playing, like bird or magic or something. But if I leave, the fans still gonna love me, man?